morning from Barcelona. We arrived at the hotel, left our luggage and now we are off to have breakfast because it's very early in the morning and we need coffee and some food. Our plan for today is first breakfast at brunch and cake. Then we will stroll around a little bit. And what's the next? The know. next spot? <laughs> La Rambla. What else? And a little bit to the beach. To the beach. <laughs> the weather is very humid. It's not too hot, but it's so humid. Like I'm sweaty already and my face is glowing. <laughs> I think we need energy before we can talk and mm -hmm. coffee. Oh yes. So I will see you when we are at brunch and cake. An organic a table. Okay. And helping the yellow pancake. Okay. And dress Okay, so what is it, chicas? We had breakfast at brunch and cake and I was not sure if it's really that good because it's a very hyped location but the food was very good. Yeah, I like it. Oh yes. Did you like it? Of course. <laughs> it was really good. I had a vegan pancake, chocolate pancake and it was very good. Daya had an acai bowl and it was one of the best acai bowls we ever had and my sister had the french toast with caramelized bananas it was a little bit too sweet but it was okay one thing is you have to wait in line for brunch and cake because you can't uh, book a table there but we waited only for 10 20? minutes 20 minutes it was not too bad for your info now we are off to where plaza catalunya plaza catalunya and then i think la rambla la rambla let's go
Santa de Real right now. I hope I pronounce it right. I'm not sure. But it's so humid and loud. I hope you can hear me. There is some kind of festivities and there is a lot going on. Oh, I think it's the national day of Catalonia and there are a lot of people. So, yes, a lot is going on. They are having a break. I think after that we will go to the beach and then to the hotel to get ready for dinner and to have a little bit of a break. That's our view, it's so pretty. I love it. We are at Rambla de Mar. It's so beautiful. There is the W Hotel. And here are some cruise boats. That's our room. I wanted to share it before it gets messy. It's cute. Small but cute. <laughs> and here is the bathroom. Now we are at the hotel because we are a little bit tired. We walked the whole day. We walked, how much did we walk? 20,000 20, steps? Yes, 20,000 steps on the first day. Great. <laughs> and it's and five, it's 5 p.m. PM. So we will still walk today because we are going to dinner but now we need to rest a little bit and get ready for dinner we got something sweet from Demasi is it Demasi? I think so I don't know if this is Spanish but yeah we got some wait a minute we got a lotus cookie and look how cute this is and that's a oh my god that's oily pistachio cinnamon roll no <laughs> it's not a cinnamon it's roll a it's a it's a this is a pistachio roll not a cinnamon roll let's taste it oh oh, oh my god oh look at that it looks delicious Mm, mm. Not so good. Mm. It tastes like mm, porcha with pistachio. It's <laughs> not sweet. Oh, it looks a little bit dry.
this tastes like chai tea latte from Starbucks. There is definitely chai tea latte spices in it. It's not really lotus. It's a bit too... What's that? Is it turmeric? What is it? I'm sorry. Sorry, my sister is eating the whole <laughs> pistachio bun in the background. They will definitely hear it's that. It's a bit too spicy for my taste. Not really... <laughs> I think she likes it. <laughs> Not sure about it. Not my favorite, both of them. Do you like it? I think it's not so bad. I'm not a fan. Let's see what Daria says about it. Is there anything in it? <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> They're all wrong. Yeah. It's a bit too salty and that's too... This one is too spicy. But I think the roll is better than the cookie. Maybe the other flavors taste better because the consistency is not that bad of the cookie. It's really chai tea latte. But I don't really like the chai tea latte spices There's in so that. Much in it. I don't know. <laughs> the, cream cream. the pistachio it's cream really is good. really good. The top, like the topping, is really good. But there is a lot of choice, so maybe you will check out the other flavors. Yes, let's continue our food experience. That's my OOTD. 
and here are the twins <laughs> wearing Ellie Studio. By the way, we are here because this was actually the present for her 18th. Now I'm 20. <laughs> now she's 20 because of the you know why problem we were not able to come to Barcelona so here we are two years later okay, good morning from day two now we are going to Casa Mia <laughs> yes then we will have breakfast and then we are going to Casa Matteo so today is a very touristy day, day, day. We will see the museums of Gaudi and I'm really excited. I've seen Casa Mia before, I think, but it will be my first time at Casa Batio. Yes, let's go. You can see Sagrada Familia over there, which is also a building Gaudi made. I think it was brilliant. I really don't know how somebody can be this talented. Look at that. And we heard that Gaudi's inspiration was the nature. Trees, mountains, animals. So pretty.
we are having lunch at Parking Pizza. Let's see how it is. It looks very good. Day, new sweets. This time we got cookies from Kukona and we have three flavors. So, this oh my god, they are warm. This one is peanut butter, carrot cake, and what was that? Chocolate, okay. dark choc, choco. Oh, oh my god with macadamia and white chocolate yes this looks so good let's eat i will start with carrot cake mm. this tastes like carrot cake it's not like a cookie it's very cakey look but really good oh my god there is a filling in it look white chocolate is it white okay. chocolate mm -hmm. yeah. is it good <gasps> oh my god oh my goodness should i bring it to you heaven wow this is like Wow, that's really good. Definitely have to go to Kukuna just for this one. Peanut butter. Look, it's a really thick cookie. Look at that. Wow, this is very sweet but good. But you can't eat a whole of it. <laughs> so after our food coma it's time for a little haul and now i'm gonna show you what i got today we went to sephora and i got this lip sleeping mask from laneige one of the most recommended products so i really wanted to give it a try because i have very dry and sensitive lips so yes excited to try this and I also finally got the Pillow Talk lipstick from Charlotte Tilbury. Let's see how it looks. Oh, yes. Then we got two prints. This one is for my cousin. She got this Playa de la Barceloneta print. Very cute. And I got this one. It's from, I don't really know Alphonse Mucha, but I will definitely Google him and learn more about his art because this was the first piece that draw my attention. I don't know why. I really like the colors and I don't know. Really like these prints. I will link the shop below. <laughs> it's 4.30 p.m. And we are at the hotel because we want to change our clothes. It's so hot and humid. What did we do today? We went to Casa Batio. Mm, the okay. terrace is very beautiful, but I would recommend you to go there very early in the morning because first it could be very hot during the day and second, it will be more crowded during the day. After Casa Batio, we went to Funky Bakers for breakfast it was really good i think i really have a sugar high <laughs> something is wrong with me then we went to casa mia or casa mila we are not sure how to pronounce it right because we heard both of it so i will say mia we went to casa mia it was so hot in it like 
we couldn't really explore it because it was so so hot and crowded but currently an artwork of Refik Anadol, who is a Turkish artist, is displayed at Kazamia. I would highly suggest you to go and see it if you are in Barcelona because it was amazing. I think it was my highlight of the day. Like, his art is really inspiring. And yes, then we went to Parking Pizza, had a pizza for lunch, and now we are back at the hotel changing taking a shower getting fresh for the evening and then yes we will see what we are gonna do Again at brunch and cake if we find a space. Um, yes. quite a lot during the last two days and now we are very very exhausted so we had a long break at our hotel room chilled a little bit got ready for dinner and and i haven't told you what we did yesterday i think no yesterday we wanted to have a drink at the rooftop bar ola but we haven't uh, booked a table 
and we waited there for half an hour but I think we had to wait for way longer. So we had a reservation for dinner at 10 p.m. but we were so hungry that we changed plans and went to Ciudad Comdal for dinner which was also on our list but for Thursday I think so yes we had dinner at Ciudad Comdal and it was so good I can highly recommend this place the food was amazing the service was amazing the vibe was great we all loved that and the sangria was good too it was a little bit strong but really good today we went to Sagrada Familia Sagrada Familia San Vincenzo and Parkwell and Parkwell Parkwell was so crowded it's very beautiful I think all the works of Gaudi are amazing that's all about today tomorrow we are having a shopping day so it will be much more relaxed i think yes i think we haven't planned anything for tomorrow only shopping eating and relaxing a little bit <laughs> dinner at Xame, so it's very dark but yes and it was very delicious did you like it i love it it was really good i had parpadelle with some meaty sauce oh here's the light grate <laughs> and it was very good it was not that touristy i think it's a hidden spot and more an insider spot I would say because there were a lot of Spanish speaking people it was really nice I liked it I could pick mission <laughs> yes now we are going back to the hotel because we are really tired yes and I realized that I'm talking very boring <laughs> and but very we really don't have energy to talk <laughs> Yes. I'm sorry for that. We're sorry for that. I will try to film during the day when my energy levels are higher. Yeah.